Thank you for having me. I'm excited to be here today to share how Finalytics.ai is using data to personalize digital experiences in banking. We started the company because every bank is going through some level of digital transformation. Community banking has always been personal. It's about knowing the customer just a little bit better and making the right product recommendations for their individual situations. And that's a hard value proposition to transition to a digital first world, which is why banks are struggling so much with digital to get it right. <clears throat> they struggle to connect with new customers. They struggle to deepen relationships with the customers that they already have. And they struggle to uncover those moments that matter where they can upsell non-interest related products. At a fundamental level, banks have a digital engagement problem that can only be solved by being relevant to each individual user through personalized experiences. Using Finalytics, banks that personalize the application experience consistently double the number of new applications. Banks that personalize product recommendations based on consumer transactions see wallet share dramatically increase as a result. And finally, banks that promote non-interest income products like gap insurance or extended warranties at the moment of need are able to, in some cases, write off 100% of the cost of our solution solely based on the performance of that one moment. And the best way to be relevant is to do it with data. Banks truly need a 360 degree view of the customer, which requires ingesting data from a vast set of resources. When banks monitor a user's behavior in the public facing digital experience, they can, they can determine interest. And when banks categorize transactional data, they can generate consumer insights that define the next best product. And then finally, when banks leverage user attributes like demographic or geolocation data, they can target the right message to the right user at the right time. We built Finalytics to be a single source solution to convert this data into personalized experiences, returning personalization wherever the user is. We enable banks to personalize on the website, in the application process, which is crucial, inside of online banking, which frankly was where most customers are. And we can also share those insights into internal systems like CRM and CDP platforms. Longer term, we plan to tap into this data from second and third party sources like the bureaus to be able to inform a richer understanding of that consumer beyond just the first party relationship that the bank has with them. We're 100% focused on financial services, which means that we're focused on the 5,000 credit unions and 5,000 banks that are in the United States. Down the road, we expect to expand into other financial services segments like insurance and investment services. Our competitive advantage continues to be domain expertise and time to market. Our competitors are generalists that require expensive, slow third-party integrations for banks' needs, while we come out of the box with pre-built connectors as a true SaaS solution, having customers live in weeks, not years, and it's working. We've, we've gotten 15 customers signed on the platform and have a pipeline of over 100 more. We have partnerships signed with Q2, the largest digital banking provider, and SWBC, one of the largest insurance providers. We're also winning industry accolades from organizations like Selen with their Model Bank of 2023 award and CULytics as their partner of the year. Our team consists of industry veterans. We've got over 150 years combined experience in financial services with three exits from the group. And our financial performance represents it. We closed 2023 with just over $1.5 million in ARR and we're doing over 1.7 so far this year. Our average deal size is about 150K. We're here today looking for our first outside investment of a million dollars from an angel investor. That is in addition to the $4 million we expect to close at the end of this year in Q4. We've been founders of fund so far today. Looking forward to engaging with you all more in the break room and sharing more about how we can partner together. Thank you very much.